I'm Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw Marco Polo. Take two fingers right here in the center underneath, I put a dot. And from that dot, I'm going to draw a curved line down on the left, come back to the dot, curve line down on the right. I come back to the left, and I'm just going to draw a curve line, curve line, curve line up, connect, come on the right hand side, and I'm just going to draw a curve line down, up, connect. I come right back up to my dot and I just draw a curve line, curve line, curve line, connect on the left, little space over and just draw me curve line, curve line, curve line on the right. Come on the inside and we're just going to draw a curve line, curve line back, connect on the left, curve line, curve line back, connect on the right. Come back to the left, we're going to draw a curved line over, up, connect on the left, curved line over, up, connect on the right. We're going to put a little curved line inside on the left, little curved line inside on the right. In the center, straight diagonal down, curved line, curved line up, and leave it floating. All right, come underneath. We're just going to draw a curve line down, up, over, curve line up, connect. Right underneath, we're just going to draw a slightly curved line, connect. Come back over here to the left. Right here at this point, we're going to draw a curve line down, connect on the left. Come on the right hand side, jump over. Curve line down, connect on the right. Now, go back to the left. Big curve line down, big curve line up, big curve line, and connect. Come up to the top, and starting on the right, going over to the left, we're just going to draw a slightly curved line, connect. Now we're going to mimic and draw it again. Slightly curve line over and connect. Now on the right hand side, curve line up, over, big curve line down, in, up, and connect. So he's got a giant hat and he's got a big old beard. All right, now starting right at this point, we're just going to draw a curve line down off the page. Come out a little more, curve line down, off the page. Come on the right hand side, curve line, curve line down, off the page. Mimic that line, curve line down, off the page. Come right here at the center part, and we're just going to draw a curve line up, connect. Curve line up, connect. Curve line up, connect. Curve line, up, connect, curve line, curve line, up, connect. Okay, I think that's all. Let's see how we're going to color this in. Okay, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to color, do my face colors. These are, this is kind of a tan, dark tan, beigey tan, multicultural. If you don't have that, you can use your brown and color lightly. But he definitely had some color to his face. So we're going to color that in. Then I'm going to double color his hair, his beard, his eyebrows, First, with my regular brown, he's got this giant beard. Then, 
and you'll do a better job than me but this is going to be a double double coat all the way over and I'm going to do the inside brown on his eyes because I'm going to color over those with my black just lightly so you can still see I'm going to do my eyebrows I'm going to do my hair mustache not a lot just to give him that double colored look all the way over up and across okay now I have my black out so I'm going to give him this big hat He's, he was wearing these gigantic hats you know this is in the 1200s 1300s so they really dressed with all kinds of velvets and brocades and all kinds of fancy hats and so I'm going to color this all in black I'm not doing the best job but you guys will all the way up and over okay then to add a little bit of color because I did do that also I'm going to start with a red And this was, you know, the way you dressed was how you showed your wealth. So you would get all decked out with all kinds of jewels and fancy cloth, satins and silks. Which is interesting because that's basically what Marco Polo was doing in his travels. Collecting all those exotic materials. So I'm going to do that blue and red, and then this is his jacket, his coat. I'm going to do green. Just for a pop of color. Jump over. There we go. And in the background, just going to give him some brown straight lines. Now you could put, you know, maps compass roses you could really go to town on him okay let's see what this looks like all colored in okay so here's Marco Polo all colored in traveled the world with his father and uncle when he returned he was a wealthy merchant made a lot of money he was thrown into prison and wrote a book about his travels, The Travels of Marco Polo, and his book would influence a lot of explorers from time on. Okay, bye-bye.